Hello everyone, Russell Wright from NetworkEmpire.com and I'm going to be answering a question that came through the help desk. I do get this question often, so I'm going to go ahead and take care of this with a quick video. The question was, how do I create the Amazon store header? Uh, and people have thought that this store looks nice. They don't really know how to do it. Um, I'm going to go ahead and show you just real quick so that I have this as a reference file in the future. All you have to do is you got to go to a store and sign up for your account. And let me just find that for you. And you got to click the join associates button and they're changing a lot. Uh, the Amazon associates affiliate program is going crazy these days. Um, so you're going to have to sign up and use your account and think all that stuff through connected to your bank account and, um, you know, that's just basically, I'm going to go ahead and log in because I have several store accounts. And we're going to go ahead and go out of the ThemeZoom store. Okay, once you log in, you're going to have an opportunity to make a store. And in the store area, you can do anything you want when you're building this store. And it's really, it really does have a lot of features. Okay, and you can see that I already have a store in this particular account, and it's got my tracking ID. And if you click on this, it'll take you directly to the store. That's the URL. You can add products at any time. But for the design functionality, it's pretty straightforward. You can duplicate the store once you have it built, and you can use any of the various templates. They've got a few templates in there already. It's just part of the Amazon Associates service. Um, when you want to edit your store, just click on Edit. Can see that function. Let me just go back and make sure you saw where that edit function actually was. Okay, there's the edit button. And once you click on that, it's a little bit confusing, so I'm going to run you through the process here. You've got all of your A store settings right here, and you're going to want to look at those. Enable mature content screening, hide category, enable an about page. If I want to, I can set up an about page, which I really need to do. So it tells you a little bit more about my company. Um, and once you get past this point, you're going to want to click the continue button. This is where it gets into adding your own logo and design. And that's where the nice uh, kind of feature that they have. You just click continue and it's going to take you into the design phase. It's the continue button that a lot of people can't really find. So this should hopefully answer the question about how do you design and tweak designs in your in your bookstore for Amazon. Okay, you can have all these different themes. Honestly, this is not that great of a design. I did have to match, customize my header when they changed the A store designs recently. So make sure that you have the correct font size and they'll tell you all about that when you log into the affiliate area and you can try your different. Oh, here's a custom logo. We recommend that it's not any larger than 200 pixels wide by 75 pixels tall, okay? And that should work pretty nicely. You can upload it to your server or to another hosting company. Um, I don't really know if they've got a way for you to upload the logo to their store. So you're gonna have to have an FTP or something else to upload your logo, okay? If you don't have a logo for your store, you might wanna get one. Um, you can go to fiverr.com and have some logos made and uh, here's a little inside tip that I promised. Um, one of the best places to promote individual books is on Facebook. I make plenty of sales on Facebook through a variety of different markets, mostly because if you really like a book or a book is really relevant to your topic or theme, you can just create an image to the book and point to your own bookstores. When you're using references from now on, point to your own bookstore for those references, and you're not going to make a living selling books on, on Amazon. But you are able to create references and authority by pointing to books that you know what the content's about. It's a kind of curation and you will make sales in that way. Okay, hopefully that's helpful. Again, go to your affiliate Amazon store and uh, you should be able to work all that stuff out. Thank you.